Welcome to Extreme Signposts. This is an example of an RFID menu. We are using a Nokia 6131 NFC phone to read and send a message from the RFID menu to an Apple iPhone. By pressing a button on the screen, an audio file is retrieved and replayed on the cell phone. We have added additional features to the menu. Behind each item are RFID tags. By placing the photo over the Air ID reader, we are able to view YouTube videos on the laptop computer. So we're looking really at the abalone video. I spent several years in Japan by myself. I'm a sunset and third generation Japanese American. Since I couldn't speak the language, I used visual aids to order food at the restaurants. It was very easy. Many of the places had wax replicas of the dishes in display cases. The friendly waitresses would help me order my meal by allowing me to point to a replica plate. The only drawback to this method was that some of the dishes were very expensive. Their prices were listed using Japanese characters. We have made an RFID menu. In this example, we have inserted MyFair tags behind the photos. YouTube videos can be retrieved and displayed by placing the photo of the dish over the Air ID reader. Personalized comments can be added to the videos and shared with friends and relatives using YouTube's email forwarding service. This is an example of the live king crab video, our first uh, item on the menu. We've made an RFID cooking pot. This allows us to recall memories from the past. Let's see what we've cooked in this before. Other examples are lumpia and Filipino breakfast. Let's try the menu out on Kai. We've made an RFID cooking pot. This allows us to recall memories from the past. Let's see so this is the RFID menu that shows the live king crab. 